Hi guys, I'm glad you're back again. So just like I was telling you a little bit earlier, today we're gonna to talk about another vowel sound. So I have my handy dandy vowel chart here. And just like earlier, I'm gonna cover up that second uh, picture for the vowel E. Now we know that we have five vowels, say them with me. A, E, I, O, U. Good job. Now, we have been seeing these short vowel pictures all here, and now we are also going to be seeing the long vowel pictures. And remember, when vowels are long, they make a different sound, and that sound often sounds like their name. So just like in A for acorn, we hear that A, okay, in that first sound in acorn. Now, today we're going to talk about E. We know that short vowel E says E eh for egg, okay? But look at this. Dun, da, da. All right, so this is a picture of an easel, okay? So when we are listening for a long vowel E sound, it's going to say E, like easel, okay? So right now, we are going to begin this paper together, okay? And it's long and short vowels. You're gonna be looking for the one that has long E and short E, okay? And you're gonna need a red and an orange. Now remember, you can use markers, you can use crayons, you can use colored pencils, whatever tool you have, okay? We're gonna do the first row together and remember teacher already did it because it's hard for me to draw when it's up in my hand okay but we're going to go through and we're going to look at the pictures and I want you to go along with me and then you can do the rest on your own okay all right so let's look at that first picture okay what is that a picture of okay it's a net N -e -et. Is that a long E or a short E sound? Short E, good job. So you can look up here at our key and it tells us that for short E, we're gonna color it orange, okay? So you're gonna color the jar orange. Now, just like I've been telling you, you may color the whole jar if you want. If you just wanna outline the jar, that's okay too. Okay. All right, good job. All right, let's look at the next picture. We have feet, feet. What do you guys think? Is that a short sound or a long sound? Right, it's a long sound because long E says E and in that word feet, we hear that E sound. Good job. All right, let's look at the next jar. We have a picture of a bed, bed, b, ed. Eh, eh, eh. Hmm, what do you guys think? Is that a long E sound or a short E sound? Eh. It's short, right, like egg. Good job. Good. All right, the next picture isn't just a crayon. It's a red crayon. So let's say red together. Er, ed. Er, ed, ed, ed. Sam, do you hear? Yes, eh, like egg. Good job, good job, guys, good job. All right, so that's gonna be orange. All right, and this last picture is a picture of honey. Honey, what do you hear? Honey, you hear the E in there? Yeah, good job. E for honey, good. Because we're listening for those sounds, okay? Good job, very good job. So I want you to finish up this paper, make sure your morning work is finished, okay? And then come back and you're gonna need two more papers, okay? You're gonna need this one, okay? and it has some boxes and you'll need scissors and glue for it, okay? And we're gonna do that one together. And you're gonna need all of your colors. We're gonna do this one together, okay? So 
go ahead and get those two papers and I'll see you back for our math.